Hi guys, welcome to Always the Wild Ones. If it's your first time here, my name is Vanessa Lee. Hello. So today we are going off to Ikea. I want to get a glass shelf for my plants and I also want to go out and check out all the glassware and just see what kind of options are out there for my plants because as you may or may not know, I do like to use um, no drainage glass vessels. I do like the aesthetic, I think they look really cool in those. So I'm going to show you what's out there, what's on offer, get some prices and then hopefully they've got some cute plants in and we can have a look at those as well. So yeah, let's get going. <laughs> So yeah, kitchen bits and bobs. Sometimes they have things here. Oh, these are pretty cool. Watch are these? £2.50. Not bad. Mm, they're quite heavy though. I'm trying to stay away from heavy glass because I have a lot of plants in glass cylinders on glass shelves. It kind of worries me a little bit. These kind of bottles, those could be really nice for propagations and stuff. What else? What else? Uh, okay, lots of sweets. Let's get deeper inside. These could be really cute to put like some of my propagating things into jars. I might grab one of those. I think the larger ones, these ones, are £2.50. Smaller ones, these are one pound. What's it say? One pound seventy five. So, here are the glasses, these are quite cute. They're two pound each. Oh, no, no, two pound for six pack. Is that right? Am I reading that right? Oh my god, that's quite good. That's a really good price. Yeah, there's a six pack two pounds brilliant I quite like these um, and what else and then these are quite cute if they were clear those would be perfect these are quite cute so you get a pack of four for eight pound oh, I quite like those those are really pretty what are they called uh, I'm not even going to try and say that, but that's what it's called. And then there's this one, which is slightly larger. It's two together. And then this one is... That's the name of this glass. If you are interested, it's pretty cute just quite simple five pound for a pack of six six pound for a pack of six so a pound each I quite like those because I like to put a reservoir water at the bottom Ooh, these are new not seen these before I quite like that how much is that uh, eight pound Not sure about the green stuff though. And then there's a clear one. I'm guessing the straw just kind of goes like that. It's quite cool. Does it come with the straw? Who knows? Can't see a box. What do we got here? Oh, we've got a jug. These are cute. It's ten pound. Okay, I just want to move on to another section now. Um, I'm not really interested in wine glasses. So in the light section, just a quick stop past carpets. How cute is that? that knitted rug. Oh, 
bring that for winter. It's going to be so cute on the floor. It's like a bit bobbly though. This one's cute. Of course, that's the one I like. The most expensive one. Do you know, it's still only 350 It's pretty decent. Yeah, it's nice that. I like that. Maybe for the bedroom. <gasps> be cute in the bedroom. And then they have some lower priced ones. I mean, this one is also quite nice. Okay. Yeah, it's 300. <laughs> but it's nice though. And then the natural woven classic IKEA. 35 pounds, wow, for this massive one. That's pretty good. What's the size? Decent. I guess you're gonna have to put a slip mat behind that though. Okay, let's move on. Black and white. My last flat I had um, rugs really similar to this. Two of them. One in the living room, one in the kitchen. Okay, so we are now in this section. So you can get some really cool vases for your plants. I've used this vase a couple of times. They're really affordable. Let's see if I can find the price. These ones are five pound fifty. Yeah, I like using these. It's like a set of three. £15. Oh, here they are. These are only a pound fifty. I really like these, especially for like hanging plants. They look really cute in those. What else can I find? Uh, there's this. I think I showed you that one earlier. Oh, and then this is the other set of three. I think these are actually £12. I don't see a price anywhere. Oh, here we go. Yeah, £12 for this set of three. Do I need to buy any more of those? Mm, I don't think I will. <laughs> what else have we got? Some nice little vessels. These are 75p for like your propagations. Really cute. Oh, they've got these really cool domes. These are like, that one's £15. Oh, they are glass. Yeah. 15 These are 10 It's quite cute. Oh my gosh, look, they're even selling stones for, to display on top of your plants. That's a really long vase. How much is that? £22. That's really good. I don't know what I put in it, but hmm. Watering cans or whatever. That one's quite cute. Look, green one. Oh, it looks like a. It looks like a succulent, a cacti. That's really cool. I like that. How much is that? It's Twelve pound. I've just spotted these little propagation thingies. Three pound for this one. Really nice cylinder. It's its name. Slightly different shape, £1.50, half the price. Very cute. Kind of slightly medical looking. And is there anything else? No, I think that's everything. Oh, hang on, there's one more. What do you think of this one? £5. She's cute. So we're at the parts. I don't normally, I don't actually use pots anymore, but maybe for some of the plants that are in semi-hydro, it could be useful. That's a cute, I like the little blue one. How much are those? Here's your price. Oh, two pound. Not bad. I've got them in pink as well. What else have we got? I've got loads of these. I think these are like 50p or something. If you get them in gold, they're £1.50. 
or a slightly larger size, which would probably be more useful. Let's have a look. How much are these? Um, saying two pounds again, but they can't all be two pounds. Oh, here we go. Look. How much are you? Yeah, two pounds. Not bad. Um, they're a bit shallow though. Ooh. What else have we got? Oh, I've had this part. I love this little dotty part. I think it's about four pound. I really like this part as well. It's quite heavy. Oh, it's really heavy. But it's really cute. Oh, this is interesting. So if you've got like a really heavy plant, you can have it on this weaver thing. How much is that? Five pounds. Hmm. Very cool. We like that. Little watering can, that's cute. Oh, and they sell chocolatiers. How much are these? I think they're five pounds, are they? Oh no, that's the plant pot. I think they're seven pound. Yeah, they're seven pound. I quite like those, and scissors as well. Which are those? They're three pound. Not that I really need them. And we've got like a little pack here with some garden tools. Not sure what the ring's meant to be for. That's quite cute. It's really thoughtful. What are the rings for? I do not know what that's for. How much is that little set? I mean, like if you want to buy a gift for someone that's planty, three pounds, then you could get that. And maybe some chiquetiers. That's such a cute little gift. I like that. Ten pounds. Nice gift. Okay, moving along. If you like wicker, they've got some wicker baskets. Twenty-five pounds. Oh, we have arrived where the real plants are. Bird of paradise. Gorgeous. Twenty-five pounds. Oh my gosh. That's just crazy. Oh, we've got greenhouses. Another little plant stand, this one, which looks a little bit wobbly. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't look good. But these are really good, it's lovely size. £25, that is really good price. <gasps> oh my gosh, I like that. That is so cool. And then the smaller one is £17. And you can also get them in the white, but I quite like the black. Oh wow, and I could put all my calatheas in there. Couldn't I? <gasps> that could be so nice. And then I could put lights inside. I really like that. Oh my gosh, I might have to get an Uber home. So I'm guessing that's a ficus or what is that actually? What do they call that? A poly. A poly. Um, we have some interesting I think this is meant to go outside I can't imagine putting this inside oh we've got some calatheas not looking too happy though for £15 oh we've got some fiddly leaf figs how much are they? ficus well these ones here are £32 these are actually £22, and they're quite a size. Oh wow, for £22, that is decent. Oh my gosh, it's heavy. Okay, let's just go back. It's a really nice size. I like that a lot. Got some yuccas. I don't know where my trolley is, but oh, there it is. Got some yuccas, how much are those? That's £50 for a yucca, really good price. Got some more bird of paradise. Look, that's what mine is gonna become. She's a baby at the moment. But holy moly, how did I not see that? Check out these peace lilies. The spapophyllums are massive. Like, they. I mean, I'm very tall. I'm guessing they're about four foot in height. And they are 27 pound. And then there's a smaller one for 10 pound. We've got some dressiers. Really nice size. Oh my gosh, those are gorgeous. How much are they? 
They are 37 pound. Really, oh, the easiest plant ever. Great beginner plant. We've got some, what are these things like? My brain just went dead. <sighs> Not my favorite plant. I mean, I love the way that they look. It's a palm. Is it a palm? No. Why can't I remember? Um, okay, they're calling it a dipsis. I don't know how much they are, but I know that they're humidity lovers. We've got some Cochura aquatica for £50 with the knotted, with the plaited stem. Really cute. These guys, much better in the garden, I would say. They grow better, they're much happier in the garden. I don't see a price for those, but they're looking gorgeous. So I just spotted this lot. We've got some Monstera Deliciosa for £14. Got a really nice moonshine Sansevieria. Check this out. 14 quid. That's amazing. Oh my god, I'm so tempted. She's stunning. That's such a good price. If you like that sort of thing. Some more yuccas, £22. £22. Wow. Oh, watering cans. I might actually buy a watering can. I don't know. Oh, look. There's some Epipremnum Golden Pothos for £3.50. I've got some succulents. Oh, I'm really hoping that I can find a succulent today. And we've got those pineapple plants for £8. Okay, I'm going to go to the other side. So yeah, this is on the other side. Yeah, we've got some peace lilies. They're three pound fifty. Oh, how much is this? It's quite cute that size. That's not the price though. Spathophyllum. What are these things called? Sorry. Oh, here we go. Gasmania. Eight pound. Not my favourite. I don't know, I've got a feeling they probably collect bugs. What else have we got? Oh, here's the succulents. Looking a bit sad. Oh, there's that little tree. £12 for that. It's like a little bonsai. Some aloe, they always have aloe. Got some enjoys for six pound, very cute. Oh, we've got some smaller Sansevieria. I love this one. Okay, should I grab one of these? Oh my god, they've got the moonshine one. I mean, this one's nine pound, but then I could get a massive one for 14 pound and then split it. You can have half, and I could have the other half. <laughs> Some more ficus elastica. We've got some alocasia and masonica for nine pounds. Decent price. Oh, let's go back to succulents. There's no one there now. <laughs> oh, these are cute. Um, where, where, where? Here. Yeah, I don't really see anything that I would want. I've had this one before, I killed it. Quite sad. I don't think I'll get another one. Um, maybe there's some more further in. But now I'm going to look for this pane of glass, which is the main reason for me being here. Here we go, aisle 12. And zero 02. Yeah, I want one of these glass shelves. Okay, so we're in aisle six, and I thought I'd best get some brackets. Uh, something like that. Yeah, that works. I'll get two of these. How much are they? Oh, they're only two pounds. Is that the right price? 
They're called Tom Holt. Yeah, Tom Holt, two pound. Grab two of those. some more plants. Ooh. Let's see what they got. Is it much of the sun or oh, they're going out more? <laughs> when I see that little plant there it really makes me want to get a bonsai love to have a little bonsai but I just don't think I'll be able to keep it alive. Yeah. And, oh there's some bird death and back here. Didn't see that earlier. Looking a little bit worse for wears. It's actually a really easy plant to take care of. Aglanemia, sorry. But for some reason they're struggling there. They just need water. The pot was really light. But yeah. If I had more space, maybe I would, but... Mm. Oh, what do I see over there? I think I see a moussa. Hang on. Hold on a minute. What have I just spotted? Oh no, it's the iron plant. Yeah, 22 pounds. I don't know if it comes with the pot. I don't think it does. All right, I need to get out of here. Let's do my head in. Check this out. I just spotted this just before I was going to leave. Like, it's a little start uni with all the essentials. And it's got like a box with all the stuff in. How cute is that? I think mean, that's just so clever. That's such a cute little present. Sending off your kids to uni. Okay, I'm going now. <laughs> that way. <laughs> Time to leave. Of course, I had to stop past the restaurant. Got myself some fries. <laughs> Hi guys, so I'm back. And um, yeah, I didn't go nuts. I went in had a good look around. There were lots of things that I could quite easily have slung into my trolley, but I stuck to the plan and I came back with the Billy Glass Shelf, which I'll show you. I mean, not that it's very interesting. It's just a glass shelf. It's 76 centimetres by 26 centimetres. And I bought two just really simple metal brackets in white. They were two pound each. And I will put that up in another video because I want to do a whole rearrange of my plants and I want to start getting them ready for winter. So I need to start thinking about lighting again and I now have more plants. You realise that um, I'm probably the worst person to go shopping with because I mean I skipped a whole part of Ikea because I really, I yeah I'm not great at shopping. When I shop, I tend to go directly to what I need. So I'm sorry I didn't kind of browse around the sofas and stuff, but oh, like the idea of running into like teams of people just raises my anxiety. <laughs> so yeah, that's how I shop. That's my style. That's how I do things. <laughs> I hope that you enjoyed the video. Please do give me a thumbs up if you did. And if you haven't hit the subscription button yet, then go ahead and do that. I'd love to see you here again. And as always, have a fabulous week and I will see you here again very soon. Until then, bye.